Welcome to the Vegas Insider Channel here on YouTube. As we break down the Monday night football showdown in Seattle, it's the Seahawks taking on the Broncos and Russell Wilson's return to the Pacific Northwest. Kevin Rogers with you. And of course, the big storyline is Russell Wilson making his return after a very long tenure with Seattle. He was drafted by the Seahawks and he won a Super Bowl, also took him to another Super Bowl. They famously lost to New England after his pick at the goal line. But now Wilson, a new uniform. He's wearing the orange and blue of the Denver Broncos and they're a touchdown favorite, nearly a touchdown favorite against Seattle on Monday night. But for our best bet, we're going to look at a total. In fact, the first half total at 21 and a half. And we're going to take the over on that. Now you say, why would you look at the over between two teams that were notorious under teams last year? Well, a couple of things. Number one, Nathaniel Hackett, the new head coach of the Broncos, came over from the Packers, where he was the offensive coordinator, so offensive-minded coach. And with Russell Wilson now running the show in Denver, where they had pretty mediocre quarterback play for a while, and you look at what they've done, at least in week one, what Russell Wilson has done in his week one games the last four seasons with Seattle, the first half in pretty high-scoring games – in 2021 against the Colts, they combined for 31 points. In 2020 in Atlanta, 26 points. In 2019 at home against the Bengals, 31. And in 2018, coincidentally, against the Broncos on the road, 27 points. So a lot of high-scoring first halves. And also this number has moved up from the original opener for the game. When you look at Seattle's side with Geno Smith, he's now taken over. He was Russell Wilson's backup last year. Spent some time starting when Wilson was out with his finger injury. And Geo Smith won the job ahead of former Bronco Drew Locke, who came over in the Russell Wilson trade. So a lot of familiar faces just switching teams here. But Seattle still with some weapons offensively for Geno Smith. And we'll see how much Pete Carroll runs the ball coming up on Monday night. But I think the over uh, 21 and a half points is the look for the best bet. And uh, the side just a little too much, a little too rich here. And I don't have enough, uh, I don't have enough faith rather in Seattle to cover the spread. So let's just go with the over 21 and a half points, root for three touchdowns and a field goal, and we'll be all set. So that is our best bet coming up for Monday Night Football. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel at Vegas Insider. And we have plenty more NFL best bet videos as we transition to week two, starting Thursday in Kansas City between the Chargers and the Chiefs. I am Kevin Rogers. Thanks a lot for watching. And as always, best of luck with your bets.